We're coming to the end of this chapter, and this video deals with the community trends that are going on with our two languages. What is the trend? Is the library getting more popular or less popular? Are more or less users contributing to it? Are more modules appearing for it, or are the number of modules stagnating and staying the same? As a brief overview, JavaScript is the faster growing language. It leads all languages by active GitHub repositories, now this counts both front and back end code. So, you know, maybe you have a PHP repository with lots of front end JavaScript that's being counted as JavaScript, but nonetheless, it's popular. And the number of PHP modules originally, since PHP was around first, was greater. But Node has overtaken it both in number of modules and in growth and size. So if we have a look at this chart, we can see that this represents the module growth. This is from the website modulecounts.com. We can see that NPM leads the pack at the end of 2015 with just about 200,000 packages. The packages repository lags behind with about 75,000, though it is growing. It's not just sort of stagnating. Compared to Ruby Gems, Ruby Gems seems to be going up kind of steadily, but at this rate, packages may overtake it sometime in 2017, 2018. If the rate continues though, NPM will just be completely off this chart before the end of 2016. And if we have a look at this table, we can actually see the numbers for average growth. And this is the number of packages that are available on these. So we can see that NPM is growing at 361 packages per day. That's over three times packages growth rate of 110 packages per day. So if we take a look at the growth trends, it's very clear what we see. Node is the fastest growing library. PHP is somewhere in a second, third place kind of hanging out behind Go. But if you're still not 100% sure, you know, do you want to switch from PHP to NPM? This is the reason for you. NPM is growing a lot faster. It's a train that's moving much more quickly towards its destination. You want to be aboard that train, and this series of videos is going to teach you how to do it.